Gaffer, it was obviously a tough day today. What went wrong in that first half in particular? Conceding after a minute doesn't help. Um, you know, we have a plan put in place and then when they score, they control the game. They get that upper hand, you know. Um, listen, I thought there were some positives in there, second half especially, but that first half we were ripped apart. We don't know whether we've just played the league winners, you know. They're, they're a good side, they look a real good side and we're still short of one or two, I think, to add to the squad, you know. The young boys came in and I've got to praise them, you know, Joe Govin's debut battle, he's got a cut eye. Stevie came on at half time, we thought he looked really sharp, really good. Sinclair, obviously we know what he brings, you know. Uh, and when we took it to Watford a little bit more, we looked a little bit better, you know, but still they got too many shots on our goal. Asmi made some fantastic saves, you know, really, really did. And uh, listen, I, I know it's going to be tough. I know it's going to, we all do, uh, just a bit of patience because I'm building. I've learned a lot today again and, and I'll keep building, I'll keep working. We've got to get better and we've got a chance to win a game next week. You know, first game of the season. OK, we've lost it and we've lost it heavily, right? Yeah, I'll take that. I'll take that. Give that to me. Stay off my players' back, please, because they're trying to give me everything and we will start winning games, believe me. Watford found a lot of pockets of space in that first half, were able to get on the ball. What could we have done more to stop that? Yeah, listen, I'll take that, you know, because uh, we tried to set a trap. The trap didn't really come off. Uh, and then second half, I changed to what I thought we needed. Uh, and as I say, you know, listen, I, I've, I'll take full responsibility. I'm the manager. Um, one or two easy goals, I thought, you know, you know, but they've had about 15, 14 shots on target. You know, it's not good enough. It isn't, you know. Um, there's some fundamentals that we do that we didn't do today. It sort of had a little flavour of when I first came in. But I, listen, I'm addressing this. I'm addressing this. We will work hard. Every player's given everything, and that's all what I wanted. They all gave everything, and the fans always said to me, can we just see everyone giving everything? Everyone gave everything today, so that's a checkbox. OK, if it wasn't good enough and Watford were better than us today, then sometimes that happens, and that happened today. I will work so hard to put this right this week. We'll, we'll sit down. We've had heated discussions in there, but I've said to the boys, stick together. I thought Asmir was sensational with his saves and the captain spoke out at the end there saying, we can stick together. We go again, boys. We go again. And he's been on the end of some defeats and he's also been on the end of some great winning type sides. I am to be on this. You know, I am to be winning enough games to make this club championship status and that's what we've got to do. But we can even outdo that. We really can. We've got some match winners in our team, you know. I thought second half, especially Elias, got on it quite well and, and got forward, dragged us forward. Like I say, the extra man in midfield really, really helped. Um, but still, there was just that too many shots, and uh, and we've got to we've got to make sure that we're we're better than that. Um, all of us, me from the start, right at the top. That's me. So like I say, it's uh, thank you for the fans who stuck around, by the way, and clapped the boys because. They're the ones who've asked for the effort and they saw the effort. And uh, I was quite pleased with, uh, with the re reaction to the players at the end of the game. It's, uh, I know some have gone and rightly so, it's not good enough. But there was a lot of positivity towards sort of Stevie and the young boys, Joe Govins, his debut with Sinclair. You know, young boys, Elijah Dixon Bonner, the, these guys haven't started a game yet for me. But they will do and I'm sure they're going to play a big part in, uh, in keeping this club in, in the Championship. You changed the formation in the second half and you changed the personnel as well. And there was improvement. How well did that work for you? Yeah, I, I saw, I, I learned lessons today. I saw what I wanted to see. Um, so again, you know, if we'd have started like that, who knows? Um, but hindsight's a brilliant thing. Everyone's got a degree in hindsight, haven't they? And they all tell me what to do after the game. Um, before the game, I was positive. I felt good. Um, Paul Smith still hasn't finished pre-season, so he was always due to come off maybe a little bit later than he did, but I thought he looked lively when he got on the ball. We've got some good players. We've got some real good players. We we just need to be right at the races from that first second, that first minute, you know, conceding a set play again disappoints me, you know, because that's avoidable for me. We don't seem to score enough the other end. Uh, but, you know, we've I think we've only had two shots on target today, and that's, that's poor, and they were from distance. We will get better, believe me. Um, don't get at the boys. Don't get at the boys. They're they're hurt. Um, they're um, you know they're down. But I'll pick every one of them up, and I'll have every single one of them. Let's finish on a strong note because Stephen Duke McKenna came on, and got himself really involved. What did you learn about him today, and has he sent you a message? Yeah, Stevie came on, uh, and do you know what? He cares so much. He gets stuck in. He runs around. He's he he added a little bit of energy 
to the to the whole performance, which I was really pleased with and proud of. And and you know, Stevie keeps playing like that. He'll, he'll definitely feature. Um, you know, we we are trying to add to the squad. We're trying to do that. You know, and and you know, whether we lose anyone again, that that remains to be seen. But I'll keep I'll keep this team. You know, believing that they can win games because they're a good outfit. We we didn't pass it as much as I wanted today either. You know, the spells, especially at the end of the first half, second half a little bit, but. Watford put a full press on us, you know, and they look very good. Um, and as I say, who knows where Watford are going to finish. We may have played the Champions. I'm sure they're not going to be finishing around that bottom four because uh, they look a good outfit. But you know what? Neither are QPR. We're not going to finish there. We're going to finish well up this table. I, I firmly believe that. We just need to get that, that mojo, that togetherness going, and, and I'm sure we will soon.